The butterfly effect is a phenomenon often brought up in time travel movies. This effect states that tiny differences can create huge changes. It goes like this. A butterfly flapping its wings could cause a tornado on the opposite side of the world. While this may seem far-fetched, it does bring up the idea of small changes causing huge differences. The butterfly effect was originally used to represent chaos theory. Chaos theory is the idea that small changes in the setup of a situation, the input, can create huge changes in the results of that situation, the output. This is why we can't make perfect predictions of the weather. 50% rain can mean anything from sunny to a downpour because a slightly higher humidity in one air pocket or a slightly lower elevation of a cloud can completely change the weather. The way that chaos theory and the butterfly effect have been adapted for time travel is by having small, unintentional changes made by the time traveler in the past have huge ramifications on their present. For example, in Back to the Future, Marty McFly pushes his dad out of the way of a car. The accident wouldn't have been lethal, but this is how his parents met. The result? He and his siblings start fading out of existence until he fixes his mistake. In our history, there are many examples of the butterfly effect. A popular one is the assassination of Archduke Franz Ferdinand. This assassination led to World War I and II, but what caused it? A sandwich and a wrong turn. Archduke Franz Ferdinand's driver took a wrong turn down a street with a cafe on it. It just so happens that his assassin was getting a sandwich there, and when he saw the Archduke, he seized the opportunity. Could both world wars have been stopped if a driver took the right route, or if an assassin didn't stop for a sandwich? Maybe. But maybe time has some sort of inherent property to straighten itself out. In some time travel movies, the protagonists try to change things in the past and are prevented by what seems to be incredibly bad luck. This bad luck is chalked up to be time trying to stay on its proper path. This would get rid of the butterfly effect. If big intentional changes can't alter the course of history, then how could small ones? Without time travel, there is no way to test if time has a rhyme or reason to it. But with the assassination of Archduke Franz Ferdinand and the start of World War I, it might have been inevitable. The assassin was not a lone actor. There was a group of people who were trying to kill the Archduke. If one assassin failed, another might have succeeded later. Also, there was a lot of tension between the European countries leading up to World War I. The assassination was just a catalyst, a spark in a dry forest. Other events could have caused the war. Basically, time might not have some force trying to push it in one direction, but many big events in history were more inevitable than just being the result of small, improbable events. In conclusion, the butterfly effect is important to chaotic systems. Anything from the weather, to the motion of debris, to even time itself could act under this principle. Or, time might have underlying order to it. We may never know. <laughs>